Hey everybody, welcome back to uh, Fallout 76. So I re-logged, figuring out uh, everyone would be, I don't know if he is yet, but I noticed that the minor locker in the burning mine is has changed from where it was there. That's interesting. Um, anyway, let's go see if Evan's alive. To kill Evan. It, it's kind of weird being like, oh, let's go see if Evan's alive so that we can kill Evan. Is he alive? He's not alive. Maybe it's a bug. Never mind. We'll carry on. Oh, two screws. Sorry, Evs. Not today, buddy. There's no fusion cell either, so I imagine... I can't imagine somebody came through here that recently, but I'll keep trying anyway to kill him, and then... Uh... <laughs> I'll keep trying to get him. It's not so bad. Uh, you know what I mean, anyway. So yeah, we'll head, we'll head to that burning mine, I think, and then uh, we'll head up to get this other part we need for the top of the world. Hopefully that should uh, should all go okay. I think we're doing all right. Oh, I leveled up as well, actually, just off camera. I had a load of ghouls attack me, and it leveled me up. Uh, I thought that was a cool thing. Well, uh, what do we want? Endurance, maybe? I could breathe underwater, that does sound very useful. Fireproof. See, that actually would probably be quite useful. Aqua Boy does sound pretty useful. No longer take damp. Uh, yeah, that just sounds really good, I think. Aqua Boy. Uh, oh, we didn't have good doggy on. Okay. Okay. I don't know why we'll take that, but whatever. Uh, okay. I'm going to head down this way. Boom. Power arm is still holding up, so that's good. Yeah, they're ready this way. And yeah, feeling good. Like, I feel a lot more powerful than we felt before, I think. Which is nice. This feels familiar, like where we got attacked by that rocket launcher time by the yeah, mole miner, but I don't think it is there, that same place. Is it the same place? It actually might be the same place, you know. Uh, so it's literally this way. I don't know what else is this way that's on my map. I'm going to... Um, oh, sod it, we'll leave it on. I'm sure I can navigate well enough. So yeah, I hope you guys are all doing well. Oh, look how green it is over there. Oh, crap, that scared the life out of me. I'm trying to enjoy the scenery, you utter scumbag. Okay, minor heart attack, number one. Oh, excuse me, I just need to go for a... I haven't even got any toilet roll. Okay, right, yeah, still this way. Yeah, it does look nice down there, though. Nice and green. Compared to here, it's just rocks, rocks and rocks and rocks. It's always a way that I think um, it's like in Elder Scrolls Online does it a little bit, and I think a lot of like MMOs do it, where you do have these kind of very barren areas, and then when you actually finally go back to a... A nice area, you're just like, oh my god, this is amazing, you know, this looks so nice here. Even though before when you were in that area, you you didn't really think that much about it. Uh, Elder Scrolls Online does it with the um, kind of like Morrowindy area. I uh, just saw some sort of green explosion over there. And another one, and another one. 
What the hell is that? Still heading this way, though. If that's over to my right, it's around there somewhere. Is there any players there? Yes, okay, so it must be these two. See a ghoul up there. The burning mine. Hello. Hiya. Such a bad shot. Takes the duct tape. What is in the burning mine? Apart from flames, <laughs> I would imagine. Okay, appears to be a lot of stuff here to. Furious combat knife. That actually could be quite good. What? 29. It's only level 10. It depends how much the damage increases by, I guess. I'm not sure I'd like it down here now. This isn't worth it for me. <laughs> I say we go about our business. Uh, yeah, we'll move on, thanks. Thanks all the same burning mind. Uh, let's take that off. There we go. Right. Okay. I don't know where that is actually. We'll have a look at these. Oh, that one's actually on the way. That one's not. But ah, take me home, country roads, to this area, I tell you. Scorchy, scorchy. Any more? Thank you. Don't I want scalpels? Duct tape, yes. My blade's almost worn down. Where are you going, buddy? Hello. Oh shit. Power armor. One B. What level? Thirty. Oh, I'm not that far off thirty. Uh, so I've got T forty five. That is thirty four, thirty four, thirty four. Yeah, it is better. It's not going to match though, is it? Hmm. 
If I take it, I'll constantly be over encumbered. That's the problem. I don't even want the fusion core. How bad is that? How bad is that? Yeah. Uh, I mean, to be fair, though, it is the top half. Guess we'd take it. I do. Nah, you know what? I'm going to scrap it. Sod it. I don't know what we get if we scrap it, though. Steel. Yeah, I just, I just can't hold it at the minute. That's the problem. We'll just be constantly. Over what? Hang on. What disease have I got? Radworms. God damn it. Why did I take that? I need disease cure. You've recovered from radworms. Right, this way, Philip. That's what I say. Oh, it's actually a little bit more this way, the circle. There, we've we've actually been there before. Cause Lewisburg is just up there. Came here when we got the, got the uh, Mistress of Mysteries quest, and that's the top of the world up there. Yeah, my blade. I need to repair. Done me proud though so far to be fair. Do you happen to have a weapons workbench in here, sir? You do not. This way. I just get confused. We've got like multiple circles. Okay, we're in the circle. Find and excavate the dig site. Well, it's definitely around here somewhere, but I have no idea what I'm looking for. So that kind of proves to be quite difficult. Maybe you have to build like a camp or something? I don't know. Build a camp and an excavator or something. I don't know. Hmm. It's like literally right on this road here. I 
like here. So I have no idea what I'm looking for. Find and excavate the dig site. Find and excavate the dig site. Nope, oh, no idea. There's only a bit of camp there, so I'm not gonna. Uh, Alright, so we need to head up here. I'm going to head to... I'm just going to fast travel it. Level 27 now, guys. We're only three levels away, I guess, from using that power armor, but... I don't want to go three levels, be over encumbered, and I have nowhere in my stash to hold it, so... We'll be okay. We'll be okay. Okay, however, let's go and find this. We know there's some nasty things in this uh, train yard because we've been here before. We're just gonna have to keep ourselves on our toes. Remember, when we had to fight that Wendigo. Although, we might have got lucky. Hey. Must look how nice it is here compared to the uh Ah, so Mr. Gutsy here somewhere. Just ignore him, he'll go away. Imagine if that hit, just imagine for a second if that hit. I'd be an internet sensation. If we've got some super mutants, I might actually try this out on them. Gas mask on still, don't actually need that on now, do I? There we go. Give myself that perception back again. Oh, there was loads of robots here too, wasn't there? Oh, it was like scorched this time. Wow. We really did not do a lot of damage there, did we? Okay, what else we got here? Ski sword. Heavy sledgehammer. What level? 
30. 91 damage. So you saw 35. No, we're not going to get to that. Way is way too much. Way is too much. Get it? Way is too, too much. I also need a Tinker's workbench. So we might have to build a base around here. Then I think there might be one up here. So we'll have a look. There may even be one at the train station. Let's have a look. That'd be great if there was. That would make my life real easy. Damn it. <laughs> Didn't thought it would be too good to be true. Have a look up here in the resort. I'm not opposed to building a camp around here, but I don't really want to. It's a lot of blood. Oh my god, look at those hooks. Goodness me. Okay, that apparently is just a dead body. Oh god. <laughs> Literally my monitor just completely spazzed out for a second there. Okay. in here. Should have run through and then triggered there, shouldn't we? <laughs> that would have been good. We are after a tinker's workbench. I don't think he's got one in there, but let's have a look. There might be one in there. If not, uh, is, um, I swear there's like workbenches around here. It was a, wasn't that long ago I was here. There's a work. Okay, there's a bloody thingy weapons workbench there. Tinker's workbench anywhere, guys? Can I help a brother out here? I 
No, no you don't. What's this thing? War drum. Is that a weapon? Level 45, 121. Shit, the bed. Okay. Oh, maybe I'll come back here. Okay. Oh boy. He's got a crossbow. What level's the crossbow? 45. <laughs> uh, I ain't ever reaching that, am I? I don't think there is a Tinker's Workbench in here, you know. I think we're going to have to buy the bullet and build a camp, but... Downstairs. Oh. Checked. We need to find that key card. Look at that. That looks interesting. Okay, but we're gonna have to build a. Uh, <sighs> we're gonna have to build a Tinker's workbench, aren't we? Oh, 
Put it like over here on the cliff. Might be the worst idea. Apparently I can't. I build it there. Sure. <laughs> okay. Yes, that will do there. Thank you. And then... Ah, feels good I can actually build this stuff now. Tinker's workbench. Need a power armor station, that's the last thing I need to find plans for. Why have I still got this gas mask on? Weird. Which ten mil have I got? Still not enough. Oh, my point four five rounds are nearly done, so I'm going to need my hunting rifle to get repaired. Uh, okay, we'll build a workbench. Nope, not that. Actually, can I? How how much does it take to make 0.45 rounds? <sighs> Might as well not do it. Uh, where's my camp? Actually, hold down V, isn't it? That's what you do. Uh, weapons workbench. Um <laughs> Ah, okay. I need to repair this. I need to repair this. Good. Okay. What does that do though? Increase damage and stealth attacks, targets bleed. It could be good. Uh uh poop shit, where's my power armor? My power armor went. Ah uh. Oh, lead. What the fuck's that one with a clone? Ah uh. Get out Ah uh, shit. God's sake. Uh, goodness me. Thank you, Iron Man. Let's go back up and defend our base. I was thinking, ah, oh, I should have built some turrets, that would work, but... Gotcha. Two 
two missile launchers. Seems a little bit greedy. What is even going on here? What I mean, what is? I don't even know what's going on, guys. I don't even know. I'll take it all and just break it down. Crossbow level is that? There we go. We'll break it down. Break it down. I need a drink. Still, because I bet I picked up missiles, didn't I? Oh, will you go away? Right. It's like a terrible idea of a place to put a base. What are you going to do, eh? Oh, black titanium. Where did we get that from? Oh. What was that picked up off that guy that got, gave me black titanium? I don't even know. Really need to use some uh, shotgun shells up. Uh, pronto. Black titanium scrap. Oh, okay. We have actually have quite a lot there. I'm gonna take that and break it down. That. So I want to drop in that, um, and not that. I want to drop in that. Yeah, just want to keep that laser pistol. It could be quite useful. The plasma pistol. I think I'm just going to break down. I haven't even got any plasma, so it doesn't even matter. Cool. There we go. We still have some. Available step space. There we go. So we've got forty five round and three oh eight. Um which is all we need, isn't it? We've got the hunting rifle blade. Yeah, cool. Okay. Right. Shall we go uh, go to the National Isolated Radio Array? Oh, where the hell's that? Who the hell's that? Oh, Jesus Christ, zombie pirate. <sighs> there. Site Alpha. 
Well, at least we can get the EMP program over there. Works out well. They've got the uh, Bloodborne outfit by the looks of it. Oh, that's pretty cool, actually. Was that the sniper outfit? I don't know. It's pretty cool, though. Shut up. Right. This is the way, right? Yeah. Let's go. Just going cross country. Oh, that's nearly broken. Oh, this isn't nice. So, it's gonna have to. Uh, it's gonna have to do, isn't it? Guess we can cross over here. Don't want to make the armor rusty, though. That looks like some sort of, like, thing we can mine. Drop there. That's okay. Where of this one? We. Geronimo. I was just thinking I probably need to eat and drink. Oh, a couple of tins of canned dog food. Love it. Cannot beat it. There's a house up here. Probably wouldn't hurt to explore a little bit if there's a way up there. Maybe there isn't though. Let's have a look up here. Doesn't hurt to find places, it gives us more XP if anything. Oh, this looks nice. It's a fox feel. Big Fred's barbecue shack, oh yeah. There's a warning shot. Wasn't just that I completely missed. Burnt ends. Post apocalyptic culinary review by Glenn Ramos. Big Fred's barbecue shack was quite the misnomer. Despite the prefix, Big Fred wasn't that big. I remember the man stood 5 foot 10 inches and, and looked to weigh 180 pounds. Lovely gentleman. Contrary to the humble images, the word shack brings off. Big Fred's made the best rack of ribs I've ever tasted. In these dark days, creative culinaries are exploring new methods with a new meat sauce. That's readily available. I must say their rendition of ribs is quite good, but it doesn't compare to Big Fred's. Five stars. Uh, what meats are they using? Slash, how do we even get in there? Oh, there's a flipping door right there, Phil. Monkrow. Okay, dog meat. Oh, it's better than what I thought they might have been using. Aluminium. 
That was Big Fred's Barbecue Shack, I guess. <laughs> Not much going on, but, you know. Gonna get rid of some of these, uh... Yeah, keep them. That's fine. Okay. This bit looks a bit scary, not gonna lie. So does that. Whoa, that's big. Holy mackerel. That's close. Not expect this, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, go to this one. Top of the world signal lost. Gonna just investigate this tiny little shack here. Recon powerful ten millimeter auto pistol. Level 45 as well. It's nice, but it's too heavy. And it's level 45. I get basically anything above level 30 I'm, I'm not going to take. Because I'll just find more of it later on. Unless it was something really special. But like a 10 mil pistol I don't think counts. Oh shit. big super mutants obviously where are they there's one shame I haven't got a silencer on this Question, where do we install the signal repeater? It's down here, apparently. I'm just going to have a look up here first. I don't want the laser sniper rifle. quite impressive. Jesus is literally blew his hands off. <laughs> uh, guess he's not so 
handy anymore. <laughs> I'll get my coat. Where the hell did they come from? Shit, look at that. Uh, see if I can't get this actually like working properly. Oh shit, did I get them all? That was a good, that was a good throw. Little Mr. Speedy Gonzalez there. With his wheels. It's like Fast and Furious. Oh, oh so much aluminium. Also quite a lot of aluminium. Oh. think she's not going to kill us? Because I'm not so sure. Let's have a look in here. Super mutant. Okay, still one more or two more. I can hear one of those beeping things. Oh. No, 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 no. you die. Oh. I can hear one of those beepy things. It's coming from over here. Oh.
Okay, now I've got to have a look in here as well. <laughs> I don't even feel like I had a good look around the other place. It's just the, the beepy noise is attracting me. It's up here somewhere. It's coming from over here, I think. Yes, this guy. Okay. No match for me, are you, buddy? No match for me. Come on, that mutant hound. <laughs> down in one. Swinging a hit. Anybody else? Door's chained on the other side. Well, now I want to get in there. Oi, that's rude. There you go. Who else? I feel that's somebody else. Is in here? I see you. She's got a rocket launcher. That was lucky. Gotcha. A oh, super sledge. I would not mind a super sledge. What level is it? 30. Ooh, yeah, I'm taking a super sledge. Don't know why I took the missiles. Still one more guy. I do want a super sledge. They are pretty sweet. Revolutionary sword. Forty-nine. <laughs> if only we could dual wield. Nichols terminal. There was a holotape we didn't listen to. Uh, where is it? Near a side doctor report. Hi. Oof. Okay, I want to go back and read that terminal now. I know that we're quote unquote safe where the hell is that noise coming from first day at Nera frankly quite nervous according to committee members they offered me the job I'll be the youngest PhD in the ionospheric physics at the facility me to show everyone I can handle any task they throw my way regardless of complexity I have a meeting scheduled for noon today with the site supervisor Dr. Dayo Ojaha hopefully you recognise my skill scholastic compliments to something challenging 
It's Thanksgiving Day and instead of spending time an hour with my folks, I decided to stick it out at the facility to finish up the first round of my project. Dr. Oja's current project focuses on data. Okay, where the hell is that bloody radio? It must be on the roof. Or down here. There it is. Damn things. Ah, yeah, yeah. Oh, well, there's one more. Hi. Ah, I got your doggy as well. I'm just going to say these mutant hounds sound terrifying. They are horrific. What is with that noise they just made? Okay, right, we're back. What read this terminal? They, that was awful. What was that? Okay, don't know if it's stressed long hours, but lately I've been suffering from intermittent headaches. I tried to mitigate the pain with over-the-counter meds, but they proved to be ineffective. After chatting with code workers, I discovered a few of them suffer the same issue. I think I'll visit to the site's medical doctor, see what she has to say. For now, I need to move on to quadrant three of my project. Can't let something trivial as a headache scuttle work for Dr. Oja. I'm to report the site's doctor seemed to know exactly what was causing my headaches. Apparently, the equipment at the site generates an excess of electromagnetic radiation. Thanks to dialectic heating, the M field around here is cooking my brain at a very minor level. Not enough to cause damage, but painful nonetheless. The doctor issued me a shielded lab to wear, which might make me look as ridiculous as the others. I've obviously wearing them, but at least I can get back to work. It's funny, I've been hard at work on a fifth contract project, but I can't help being distracted by the whole headache EM field debacle I suffered. I spent the last month or so juggling the original project with finding out the way this array has given us such a huge EM field. According to my investigation, the nearest shouldn't be up in so much electromagnetic energy. It's almost as if they aren't using it in a narrow band as expected, but trying to cover a huge area all at once. Not sure what all this means, but it certainly piqued my interest. So that has to be something to do with the EMP research project, which we also have to go and do. Um, yeah, has to be, doesn't it? What is downstairs? Dead rad roach. And a not so dead rad roach. No dead rad roach. Terps. Don't really need any terps. Ah, fusion core. Brilliant, just what I needed. Harpoon gun. Hello. Level 30, but it's so heavy I can't use it. It would be pretty good though. They're not actually that good. I've used them in Far Harbor, which is where they're from. And uh, they're not actually very good and it weighs so much. But cool that that's a thing. I look forward to maybe using it one day with my uh, stash is uh, able to hold a bit more. Super Sledge weighs 16. Does 101 damage though, which is... Actually, is it that good? I don't think it's going to be better than the Blade of Bastet. Because it... Yeah, let's get rid of it. Get rid of that level 50. Jesus. Thirteen fusion cores. Okay. We are still over in cupboard. Have I got anything else? Hunting rifle, shotgun. Yeah, we don't have much else actually. I'm actually fairly low on the dog food there. It's got too much junk. Hmm. 
Okay. That door's chained, wasn't it? Yeah, I remember. <laughs> Sorry, I've got hiccups. Can we get in there through here? How do we get in that door? It's chained. Okay, we can get through it from the from up top. Uh, five missiles. Loading dock storage key. Interesting. Loading dock storage key. Oh shit. Where's the loading dock? Hmm. Dock storage key. Now I'm intrigued. But, I think what we'll do is we'll finish up there. Uh, next time we'll head over, pick up this EMP research program over here at Sugar Grove. Uh, let's see what that's all about. And maybe we'll kind of have a swing around some of these places as we head back. Or maybe we won't. I don't know. I can't. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, thank you so much for watching as usual. It's been my pleasure. I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.